the hang of this boss fight. Huh? He saw him. Lino, snarf, snarf. You said take this. I thought that you picked something up, you son of a bitch. My name is a pizza face because I'm a made of pizza and I have it a face. Oh, uh, that's gonna be in season two of uh, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles cartoon show on Nickelodeon. I went to the Turtles booth. Uh, I mean the Turtles panel at Comic Con. Welcome, excited. I... Maxi's tickets go on sale in a couple of weeks. Oh, dude, can I go with you? Yeah. Nice. Just I need to figure out. I need to figure out how much they are and how much money I need to get for it. I'm only hurting with boxes right now. It's turning out pretty well. But um, yeah, dude, that's gonna be sick. Oh, dude, I'm fucking his day. Did you see him there, or? No! I just assume- oh. I just assume he's right behind the train- shit! Oh! Eh, snarf snarf, Lino snarf! Fuck your arm! Yeah, bitch! I know you did not just beat him using only boxes. I did beat him using only boxes. And that's now gonna be known as the Mark Delano Challenge, ass fucks. Spinning letters. Give me that S rank. Give me that D rank. Give me that A rank. Give me that B rank. Just don't give me that C rank. I got the B. Stuff B's my mouth. Big old titties. B is for better stuff your mouth with my B's. My balls. Okay. <laughs> no, my breasts. My luscious, luscious boobies. Oh, dude. Oh, well, I was looking at something the other day, and they referred to boobs as something really funny. It was like jibs. I think it was a typo, but I just want to believe that someone calls. Yeah, it was supposed to be jugs, I feel like, but it was like jigs. Yeah, <laughs> jigs. A jig is a dance, Tim. Oh. You don't have... Oh, yeah, we got the best clip. Best scene in the story. Best scene in the movie. Best scene... Oh, he's like... Aah! And Shadow's like, I'm too Chaos cool. control! Blam! And then she's fucking Silver died from brain hemorrhaging. And we didn't have to play his story, right? Right? <laughs> you use chaos control? I thought only Blaze could use that. So I don't understand. In, in, in the Sonic comics, it's a lot clearer because they, 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 they didn't make anything confusing. But in this, in the Sonic games, uh. is this a different Blaze than the Blaze from Sonic Rush? I don't know. I because feel like Sonic Rush Blaze is from an alternate dimension. Yes, the Soul Dimension this... with Soul Chaos Armor. This Blaze is from the future, which... So, like... Could it mean that they're, they're just parallel universes? It's yeah, like, or, Blaze or, or, or did Blaze come from her dimension and hung out in ours in the future at some well, point? Well, all I know is that Blaze is from the Soul Dimension. That much I know. Yeah. They have said this. In this game? No. The creators have said this. Yeah. They said... Blaze is from the Soul Dimension. So why is she in this game and why is she in the future? And why does she have a love interest with sh fucking Silver? Maybe she came from the Soul Dimension into the future and then the future was like shit. And, and she, she tried to help? Or maybe even her dimension got destroyed so she's taking refuge in this dimension <sighs> and I... trying to save it before it got destroyed. Let's go with that. Because it actually does make sense. But why does she like Silver? He's so lame. He's not lame. He's, he's just so, gullible as fuck. He's, dude, I mean... He's Whoa, not, graphics are I was going to say, oh yeah, look at this fucking pre-rendered cutscene. Right? But I bet it looks really bad, too. I was say, <laughs> it looks shit. Oh my god. This whole game looks shit. It looks GameCube level. GameCube Ga looks better than GameCube this. GameCube does look better. Oh, uh, hello. We are the scientists supreme. We're working on this, uh, big laser vault. Fucking A! Can't you realize that Sonic the Hedgehog stole my daughter's virginity? What? Daddy, Sonic took my virginity. What? Okay, I have a question. What? What the fuck was that little girl doing in this laboratory? In her pajamas! Dude, Sonic just fucked her and they brought her here for safety. Even as a child, Sonic wanted to fuck humans. Mark. Yeah. Gotta no. go fast. No. Gotta Mark. go fast. Gotta no. go fast. Gotta go fast. Inside. Gotta go fast. Gotta come fast. <laughs> no, this, wait, this is funnier than it was like the, the you know how there's like the demotivational pictures and stuff. Mm -hmm. I found one of those. It's a picture of Sonic with his hand on Amy's belly and she was pregnant. 
And it's all the caption says, "Looks like you weren't fast enough to pull out." Jesus, ew. Gotta go fast. <laughs> we'll have to split up. I'll pursue Mephiles. I'll go fight Iblis. And Sonic will fight both. Right? Sonic does. Wait, does Sonic have any interaction with Mephiles other than dying? No. That's his first interaction with Mephiles. <laughs> so he's just like. He's like. Who the fuck are. <laughs> no, he doesn't see him. His back is to Mephiles when it happens. That's so great. Him and Elise are just walking like. Yeah, we're so happy. Love. I can't wait to bang you. Then Mephiles is just like. <sighs> you want shit done right, gotta do it yourself. And then, Get over here! Oh shit, what? Okay, you know what? That, that's perfect. And then Shadow's like, don't worry, we can bring him back with the power of love. I mean, the chaos almost. At least, like, no, no, no. Love works perfectly. And then she, fine. like, tongues a hedgehog. A dead hedgehog. Oh god, she's a necrophiliac and a bestiality. Oh no. This looks so. Dumb. She's a Twilight fan. Oh! Hey. Twilight's. Done nothing to deserve as much hate as it gets. I don't hate Twilight directly, honestly. <laughs> I hate. I hate what it does to females. Yes, I will give you that. Um, because number one, they become irrational. If you say anything that disagrees with how they believe it is, they suddenly. I just think that everyone. I just think the stories are sexist because they make women dependent upon men. Extremely. And Kristen Stewart is sexy? Question mark. <laughs> I still can't decide if I think she's sexy or not. Are you talking about Bella Swan? The is that the her, name of the character? Her, her character's name is Bella Swan. I mean Kristen Stewart, though. You're talking about the girl, the main character of Twilight. Who can't show emotion, yeah. Bella Swan. Yeah, I can't tell if she's sexy or not. Um, I, personally, I think no. Personally, I prefer the air. But, you know. uh, personally, I prefer the mom. Personally, I prefer original jokes. Zoop. <laughs> okay, I'll give you that one. <laughs> Boom! Oh, cool, I can go on like three different levels of Kaioken, or I can like store Kaioken, it looks like. No, uh, but what was I gonna say though? Oh, it's like, first off, Bella Swan, because she's. She, they spent. Uh, okay, so Belle. Dude, her baby is gonna get fucked by a werewolf. Yes, it is, but that's besides the point. What I'm gonna say is number one, Belle stands for beautiful. Beauty and the Beast. Of, well, no, it's beautiful in French. Wow. So yeah. you're telling me... Let me finish, let me finish. No, okay. And then, you know how swans are meant to be like the most beautiful creatures, right? Uh, apparently, yes. The author spends so much time in the book talking about how plain she looks. Well, it's not her fault that her parents gave her a shitty fucking name that didn't go with her at all. First off, no, it doesn't... I mean, more so the author naming the character that and such. It's yeah, I know like, what I'm really... <laughs> I'm just like fucking real. I'm like, that's not even clever. This is what's come to Tim. I just want you to know we're playing Sonic 06 and discussing Twilight. I think we've hit an all-time low. <laughs> yeah, probably. I <laughs> think I think we should just end it tonight. We'll just tank through the game. No, I mean kill ourselves. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh god. <laughs> I, I, I love how you interpreted that. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, jeez. Oh, God, no. Oh, yeah, no, I wouldn't actually kill myself. But still, um, so you're telling me that Belle means beautiful in French. Yes. So in Beauty... Oh, fuck. Yes. That's so why in Beauty and the Beast... In the original song, Belle, they actually did the line, it goes, I guess it's no wonder that her name means beauty. Her looks have gotten a parallel. That is an exact line from the song. That is an exact line. So, you're telling me... The Bell's dad was like, "My daughter's gonna be a knockout, and I know it." So, yeah. because her mom was clearly a knockout. Yeah, and she clearly wanted to fucking bang fat ass Maurice, who's uh, a crazy careful, genie. Be careful about your green bar there, because if you're not careful, you will. Oh die. yeah, no, I know, man. I gotta let it fill up. Alright. Uh, is that supposed to happen? <laughs> Uh, it doesn't look right. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Uh, 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 okay, we're good, we're good. We're good, we're good. <sighs> Motherfucker, you underestimate me. Apparently. Yeah, bouncy balls. It's like, because people try... But, okay, back Silver's actually not that bad to play as. This is actually, dare I say, a fuck. A tad enjoyable. Just because I like psychic powers. Now, I don't mean to go back onto the whole... Twilight. Yes, but... Okay. It's like... 
I've actually tried to read Twilight. Okay, fair enough. Because it's just like, I don't like giving something hate my own hatred without at least giving it a chance first because that's just the type of person I am. Yeah. So I'm, I'm tempted to read it. The writing is bad. The writing is bad. It's it's pretty god awful. And then it's like there's the character development is really bad. The characters' interactions are pretty eh at best. And a werewolf wants to fuck a baby. Yes, that too. But that's besides the point. <laughs> it's like my Did Shadow just die? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> no! Maria! Maria! <laughs> Shadow! Silver left me to die, Maria! <laughs> yeah, but it's like, the books is like... I don't even know how to, I don't even know how to put it. It's like, they're uh. not well written, the character development's not there. And the people like go, oh yeah, this is far better than Harry Potter. No, I'm a Harry Potter fan. And I'll acknowledge that Harry Potter's not a book for everyone. <laughs> But it's like, Wee. it's like, how are you, you? You cannot be that delusional. Think that, dude. Oh, I, don't, well, I don't know what's going on anymore. Oh my God, Mr. J, I need your help to fight Batman. <laughs> what? I I was Harley Quinn. Oh, <laughs> I thought you were Rosie from the Jetsons. <laughs> <laughs> You sounded like Rosie, and she called Mr. Jetson Mr. J. Oh my god, that's really fucking funny. <laughs> so I it's never like, knew that. That's what I thought. Oh god. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I've never... I can't watch the Jetsons. <laughs> I find it really boring. I, just, I love the Jetsons and the Flintstones. Yeah, I couldn't watch the Flintstones either. You ever seen the Flintstones meet the Jetsons? Yes, I have. I love that movie so much. But it was a really long time ago, so please refresh my memory. Basically, Did the Jetsons go back in time? Um, initially, yes. Basically, they wanted to go back in time to... For vacation. Go, exactly. And then the time machine thing is fucked up. They end up with the Flintstones. They spend time with the Flintstones. Fred uses a lot of the amazing gadgets that George has to impress his boss. What an asshole. That's going to destroy time and space. Nope. 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 And so like, all, <laughs> all that happens, and then somehow the Flintstones get thrown into the future, and when they get thrown into the future, uh, all uh, Fred and Barney become like these really big like people because it's just like, oh my god, you're from the past, that's awesome! And then it's like, it's like it's so ridiculous because it's like they take Fred's car like from the Flintstones and turn it into like some awesome machine, like. Awesome, like vehicle. It's still powered by feet. No, it's like they turn it into like an awesome machine, just like based on its design. Oh, it's kind of cool, I guess. And then like it's it's hilarious. Oh, cool a coin. And then oh, is the Great Gazoo in it? I want to say no. Is um, what about Wilma and Betty? Yes. Every every all is, of the oh, hey, does it take place before or after the Pebbles and Bam Bam show? Uh, before. Pebbles and Bam Bam, I believe, are children at this time. I'm oh. with toddlers at this time. You ever watch Pebbles and Bam Bam? Yes, I actually love the Pebbles and Bam Bam show. It was awesome. When was that on? Um, I don't remember. Did you ever see the Pebbles, uh, the Pebbles and Bam Bam movie? Like the Flintstones movies where like Pebbles and Bam Bam, they get married in one. They yeah. have another one where they have a baby and stuff. There's one where Fred becomes. There's a Flintstones movie where Fred becomes a secret. What was agent. the point of that motorcycle? <laughs> wait, wait. Did you say where Fred becomes a secret agent? Yes. Would you like me to explain? Yes, please. Basically, what happens is there's a secret agent who looks identical to Fred in every way, and he gets injured. So the company comes, and they get like, okay, we just need you to take his place for a while. And then so after something happens, Fred pisses off the guy. He gets better, and then Fred pisses off Wilma and Betty and Barney. Oh. All by doing something to Wilma, and they all get mad at him. So then... It's like, but it was all related to the secret agent stuff. So the secret agent comes in, and he's nice. he opens the door for them. He's like, oh, go ahead. And they all beat the shit out of him and put him back in the hospital. <laughs> That's really but funny. It was, it was actually really enjoyable. And then Barney finds out, and Barney helps Fred. He's like, oh, Fred, I didn't mean to beat that guy up for you. I just wanted some fruity pebbles. <laughs> so like, Barney, you son of a bitch. I swear to God, stop fucking my pebbles. I mean, eating my pebbles. <laughs> I just realized that his daughter's name is Pebbles. <laughs> I was like, he fucks the cereal. And I was like, wait, 
Yeah. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Funny story. Um, I, you know how there's a scary part of the internet, right? Oh, there I is, know. There's a thing where it's like Fred looking through his window of his bar and he stopped eating my pebbles. And, and he's he, eating out pebbles? Yes. Oh, God. Throw that image up. No. Censor it. Nope. Censor it with censor it with a big old happy face. No, censor it with John Cena's face because he promotes Fruity Pebbles right now. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't do it. Why? The, the you thing. just have John Cena's face over her tits and her coochie mama. No. And Barney's dick that's probably also in the picture. Barney's throbbing like homo erectus dick. Homo erectus is the man who stands upright. See? It has nothing to do with being gay or having an erect penis. See? I just wanted to share that with you. The more you know, G.I. Joe. We just combined two PSAs. <laughs> the Flintstones and Hentai. All into one thing. America. America. Fuck yeah. I'm coming again. So, again, I don't know what I'm doing in this story anymore. Oh, neither do I. I know you're back. I know you somehow... I went back in time. To when Mephilus was first released. Cause Not nearly as cool as when I went back in time and I got to see Shadow save Maria while I was Shadow trying to save Maria. Remember that? In Shadow the Hedgehog? I don't remember shit from Shadow the Hedgehog. Oh, dude, we should play Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> I've played it already. With we Gale. should play it Shadow the Hedgehog. We should play Shadow the Hedgehog so we can shoot people and use the Billy Hatcher suction cup gun. It looks like Billy Hatcher in the giant egg. Billy Hatcher and the giant egg. Billy Hatcher. Lights out in the world and we'll save the day. Da, 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 da. And roll your egg this way. Billy Hatcher and the giant egg. Billy Hatcher and the giant egg was one of those games that like it's really everyone crazy. looked over and they just like were like, oh no, their game's gonna be so dumb. And like it's one of the like best games that no one played. It's such a it's such a fun and clever game because it's like. For those Yo, do, you have, do you have Nights? Journey into Dream? No, I don't. I've heard of it. I've never actually had the fortune to play it, though. Oh, wait, also, oh, um... So, apparently, Nights... Is a girl? No, no, no. No. No, I actually, I actually do believe Nights is a girl. No, Nights is a... Apparently, Nights is whatever gender you wish it to be. But they refer to Nights in the game as a dude sometimes. Yet, it's very clearly a woman. So, it's just so confusing. Also, do you have a Sega All-Star Races Transformed? No, I don't. You should get that I shit. I have Sega Superstar Tennis. No, you should get Sega Superstar Racing Transformed. You know I've why? Heard it's really fucking good. Yeah, one, it's on Wii U. Two, it's incredible. Three, it's got Wreck-It Ralph. Four, it's got Knights. I'm going to wreck it. Five, it's got NASCAR Bitch from the GoDaddy commercials. Um, what? You know. Oh. What's her name? Uh, fucking. It's in the Go Daddy commercial. You know, Go Daddy. Question: Have you realized that these levels seem, go to, get, Daddy. seem to be getting infinitely easier? Yeah. So it's not just me, though, right? Yeah, no. These mo these movies, these missions are really easy. I'm getting bees, dude. Wait, do you even have to go to Soliana as Silver? I don't. I feel like the answer is yes. I want to say yes. Why though? Um, doesn't make sense. You don't need a hub world for this game. It's not like Sonic Adventure where there were different worlds and stuff and it was interesting. You go to forest to go to forest levels and stuff. Yeah, I know. It was dumb, but who cares? What do you mean who cares? We have to play it. Oh, boy. I can't wait for another disappointing boss fight. Or is this one just a cutscene? Uh, it might be just a cutscene. Oh, yeah, because Mephilus is still just a gooey goo. And then we put him in the dildo, and that's why he's mad when we release him from the dildo. And Shadow's like, I have no idea what you're talking about, because Shadow didn't do it yet, but technically he did in the past. Yeah, I told you that. Time, I know, time travel. <laughs> time travel, who? Fuck who, yeah. who are you? I'm Shadow the, Shadow the Hedgehog. You know about how there are different theories for time travel and time paradoxes and stuff? Yeah. There's one theory that a lot of things will go by, and I hate it. What? The butterfly effect. I actually am not a fan of butterfly effect at because all. Because it doesn't make sense. Because it's like, if you go back in the past, you're going to do something that's already been done. So, it has already happened, so you cannot change the fact that it is I was going to say, yeah, because the whole pre-existing timeline thing, I prefer the alternate timeline 
thing where if you do something, if I go back in time and I kick your mom in the face and she dies, 